Do you believe in any elimination of any government agencies? Which ones, if so, which ones and why? You'd have to eliminate or pare back some of these. Uh, clearly, HUD was supposed to be monitoring the housing crisis. They didn't do it with, with Fannie and Freddie. And they, they, that company, private public, was in fact making contributions to members of Congress. They, they shouldn't be doing that. The Department of Education was started in 1980, I think, with about 13 or 14 billion dollars. Obama's recent request says he, he wants 76 billion dollars to run this agency. I, there are 50 state departments of education. There are departments of education in the territories. We don't need that. Now, what would I do? I would look at the Cato Institute has a kind of a way that they want to cut the budget. I don't necessarily agree with everything they have, but it would be starters for me to say, this agency goes, this function has got to go. I mean, HUD clearly has got to be pared back from what they're doing. You, you do need some, you know, commerce. But one of the problems we're running into is we are subsidizing the export of some of our wealth. Some of it is, in fact, goods that are used militarily against us, as when this company in Manassas sold the equipment to China so they could merv the warheads to come back to us which, now that we have a greater military threat, we have to build other anti-missile MIRV warhead defenses to stop the stuff we sold them in the first place. If you stop that, you can stop some of this cycle of really unnecessary military spending that comes there because we gave away the secrets to the store.